What's good with y'all, man? Hey, so quick disclaimer. I already know this video finna go crazy. So I'm just gonna establish a big pause. All right, this is the pause to cover the whole video because it's gonna be some wild shit I'm be saying. And I know guys gonna be like, oh, whatever, bro. For the immature people, for I don't care. The, the big pause right now for what we finna get into. All right. Listen, how to last longer in bed. Now, the problem with most guys is you busting too quick because you're used to jacking your Johnson and finishing fast. You jacking fast. You a jack of all trades. Two-handed bandit, right? You go akimbo, right? It's Call of Duty in this bitch. Bro, ambidextrous. I could go on all day with this pause. I got to pause with that one too. Real talk though, okay? You got to stop the porn. The porn is killing your sex drive. Okay, that's one thing, right? Porn is psyching you out. Fellas, there's an issue with porn on multiple levels, but what we're gonna focus on in this one is the mental aspect and the physical. All right, so the mental aspect, you're psyching yourself out because more than likely a lot of y'all is not smashing or even around chicks that attractive, right? And plus the whole, you know, they, they, they shoot multiple rounds and they edit it to make it look like it was one session, whatever. All right. A lot of times while you're doing this, you are jacking as fast as possible. OK, so that is literally making it seem like because you got to understand something when you're in bed with the chick. You are confusing your pleasure, the dopamine effect that you're getting from the porn with sex with this chick right you got to kill that you got to kill that you got to stop watching the porn you got to stop busting too quick you going at that shit like a damn jackrabbit you got to chill out that's your freaking hand bro you supposed to write shit you supposed to put a fucking pen in your hand not your fucking johnson my nigga so listen bro if you chill out on that that's gonna be one thing so chill out on the porn guys I don't, the mental aspect is what's mainly the killing of your sex drive the mental stimulation the release of the dopamine you're getting the reward without putting in the work and once you get to the business with the chick you're kind of already psyched yourself out into busting fast because you see the excitement on the screen and that equates to you jacking that shit like a damn rabbit so chill if you going to do it regardless, all right, now we're talking about a whole different thing. This is how you last longer. Okay, period. The technique that you got to do, number one, Kegels. Okay, guys, you got to do Kegels. There are certain exercises that you can also do. Probably put an image up. I'll find one or something. But you want to make sure you do Kegels. You don't know what a Kegel is it's your pelvic floor you got to tighten it up right practice tighten it up releasing tighten it up releasing do that about 50 times right do that about 50 times you will have better control right so when you smashing a chick you'll be able to literally hold your nut from coming out okay that's why i said guys in the beginning i told you it's gonna be crazy that's why i said what i said in the beginning of the video but G shit, this is real talk. Okay, this is real talk. You'll be able to have better control over your Johnson so you're not blasting off too fast, especially when you're with a bad chick. Let's say you do get the chick in porn, right? Let's say you do get a chick that look like that if, if that's your, whoever your type is, right? Let's say you get that bad chick. Bro, you gonna be Jimmy Neutron in this bitch in about 1.2 seconds. You get with her and you used to going two-handed bandit like a jackrabbit. And you finally get her, you're gonna be like, damn, you're gonna be done, bro. You're gonna be done, son. So you gotta chill. You gotta chill on that. Kegels will help with control, okay? Which helps with your stamina. Now, the next thing, guys, if you go on jacket, okay, if you go on jacket, let's say, fuck it, hey, we're men. Some of us have a supremely high sex drive. Some of us, I do too. Uh, you know high testosterone and shit and you just maybe you just be horny all the damn time i don't know different age groups watching this too so whatever the case may be right if you are going to do it 
you have to practice edging, right? It's a, it's a technique of getting you to the limit, right? And while you're doing this, guys, I want you to, first off, if you're going jack off, bro, jack off slowly. Don't be going crazy fast like a damn rabbit, first off. That's going to help you control the pace, right? Because pacing is also something when you fucking the chick. Pacing, guys, you need to be able to switch levels too. Sometimes stroke them and beat it fast. Slow it down. Get some good long strokes in. Like it's a it's a tempo that you want to switch up to keep the woman excited. To keep the that's all that's all gonna affect your sex. It's gonna make your sex game better. Period. Period. Um, they enjoy that stuff, bro. So you want to practice if you gonna if you gonna make it practice right. We gonna talk about practice here. All right, AI. We're going to talk about practice. So let's say you're just doing it to practice building your endurance. If you're going to do it, bro, do it slowly. Okay, slowly. Do not be out there like a damn jackrabbit. You got to chill. You're trying to build endurance. If you're going to make it something, make it practice and use it as a tool to build your endurance. Edging is when you get to the limit and then you stop. You control yourself. So while you're doing the edging, you want to do it slowly. Okay. If you go on jacket, jack slowly, not fast. Okay. You get to the limit. You finna blast off. You stop. You stop. That's the edging thing. That's the whole notion of the edging. It gives you better control, guys. It helps your endurance. It's going to help your stamina. That's what you need in order to last longer. Okay, because when you I'm telling you guys, when you get with the bad chick, all this is great when we're talking, hey, be the best version of yourself. This all goes into it, right? Because we talk about being great at everything. You want to have a great sex game, too. Okay, so this is one of those kind of videos, bro. You got to be efficient in the bedroom, you know? So like I said in the beginning of the video, this is a major pause. But hey, this kind of topic came up. So I'm like, I mean, gee, shit. Guys need to know. You need to know what you're doing wrong. So stop the porn. The mental is what's really affecting you. The dopamine release, the reward without putting any effort or any work. So when you finally get the chick, you don't want to be inefficient. We talked about the Kegels. All right. Do the Kegel exercises. Do them continuously throughout the day, guys. Like you can do it. The great thing about it is you can do it anytime, any moment during the day. And people won't even know you shouldn't be concerned with what the fuck people fuck people anyway if they looking at you and shit fuck that shit but it's not like they can tell you know what i'm saying you should practice it every single day that alone is going to do a lot for you and uh there is a stretch too should have put that image there i'll put it again also guys edging jack slowly all right with this kind of stuff you're going to be more efficient It'll help you with switching up tempo too, right? Because bitches love that shit. So y'all be easy, man.